Hello traders, get ready to navigate the Forex market with precision. Join our weekly video series as we analyse the market movements and share our insights to help you make more informed trading decisions. Before we start, please go over our general financial product advice warning. So as always, this information is provided only on general financial product advice basis. This is only educational in nature. Trading securities, derivatives, CFDs, foreign exchange contracts can be risky and is not suitable for all. No information received from NP Financials shall be considered as a financial trading recommendation. Okay, so please take a moment and try and get through the rest of this. Okay. So what we can look at this week for our four hour time frame on our four hour series for our weekly setups, we have the Euro USD. Okay, we've had an impulsive down. We've had a corrective up. We might still be correcting up at this point in time. We may touch this dollar ten area before we start our next impulsive move down. Okay, next we have gold, kind of similar. We have our impulsive wave down. We have a corrective which has started to come up. The correction might come all the way up to around 2025, 2030 before we can see another impulsive wave down. So oil, again we've had an impulsive wave down. We can anticipate to see a corrective wave up, possibly up to around $80 before we will look for another impulsive wave down. So again, impulsive, corrective, impulsive. Okay, we have the Z200 or the ASX200. We've had this impulsive move all the way up here where we are anticipating a longer corrective wave down, so a longer duration before we can anticipate another impulsive wave up. So again, impulsive, corrective, impulsive. And finally, we have the Bitcoin. So we've made an impulsive wave down. We can expect to see a corrective wave up potentially up to around 29,000 before we can look for another impulsive wave down. Okay, so that's it for this week, guys, on the four-hour time frame. I'll talk to you next week. Bye for now.